Hey everybody, I'm glad to be back. I know it's been a while, but I want to tell you that I'm going to give it another go. And today I'd like to work on a really fun project that me and my four-year-old son started. This wooden model car. I thought it was super cool. He did too, until we started putting it together. And that might be why right there. It's made for six-year-olds, not four-year-olds. Why didn't I see that? Anyway, after about an hour, this is what it turned into. So I figured this would be a great opportunity for another project to share with you guys. So let's get started. All right, guys. Like I was saying, uh, me and my son started this project. Um, he was super excited. He thought it was awesome. I could see the excitement in his eyes. And then we started popping the pieces out, and he was like, oh crap, this is a lot harder than I thought it was going to be. And he was right. <laughs> um, I helped him out a lot in the beginning, but he eventually gave up and decided to go do something else. So I thought it'd be a good idea. Um, revisit some childhood memories. You know, by myself, I used to do these a lot when I was a kid. Um, I done a lot of dinosaur stuff. I didn't, I didn't really even know they made cars until they, until we found this. Um, but I, I actually had a lot of fun with this model. It was a little bit harder than I thought it was going to be, but. It wasn't too awful bad. I mean, I've seen a lot more complex uh, designs, which actually looked really cool. If you go on Amazon, there's all kinds of different uh, fancy wood models. I think they got like a puzzle box and some kind of flower that opens up when you turn the base or something. Um, if you'd like to Maybe see one of those. Uh, let me know in the comments because I'm actually really interested in trying that. I think it'll be a lot of fun. Um, but, uh, I don't know what else to say. <laughs> This was a lot of fun. <clears throat> At one point, and you might see it in the video, um, I actually thought I had lost a piece, but it was actually the first piece that I used. I was crossing out numbers on the little diagram, and apparently I crossed out number one to where I couldn't see it anymore. And when I got to this particular number, it, uh, Number one was nowhere to be found, so I didn't know it was already inside the car. I actually got up for like 15 or 20 minutes looking for that piece. And uh, please forgive me for the uh, bad video. I, uh, I'm going to get used to editing videos again and figure out all the tips and tricks that I need to know. Doing this really brought me back to my, my childhood. My mom and dad used to give me one of these and just be like, here you go, have some fun. And I, I don't remember how old I was, but I remember really, really enjoying it. And my dad would help me out and my mom would help me out and all that. Something about creating things is just, just makes me lose all sense of time and space really. I think I was working on this for a total of like two hours. I remember starting 
、えー、maybe 11 o'clock at night. And then after the, the Mod Podge and all that stuff, it was already like, what would that be like? 1 30, 2 o'clock in the morning? I was like, wow. I must have really been digging this. If you'd like to see more videos like this, please let me know because that, like I said, I really had a lot of fun. And、um, I'd like to get your input. You know, I'm going to try to start taking YouTube more seriously. And I'd like to see what you guys want to see. You know, I don't want to make content that you don't want to see. What fun is that? But on a side note, I've been,、uh, been trying to work on a lot of projects and build up my skills. and For drawing and visual art and all that stuff. I got, I got a lot of big plans in the future.、Uh, I'm going to try some animation at some point.、Uh, I know, like, the very, very basics.、Um, I think it'd be a lot of fun to develop some kind of show or series for YouTube. Um, I have I've had an idea for this penguin. You might see him in the background. I haven't came up with a name for him yet. So maybe you can suggest names in the, in the comment section. That would be awesome. And maybe scenarios. What kind of scenarios would you like to see in a show about a penguin? Recently, I've actually decided to try to do some coding. I don't know if you'd be interested in seeing that or not. I know it's not typical for the channel, but it's something I've been interested in for a really long time. And I've always wanted to try it.、Uh, I've tried Blender, and that's really complex. It takes a lot of time to learn. Uh, 3D modeling and animation. I know, like, bare bones uh, uh, of Blender 3D, which is a great, I think it's a great 3D、uh, open source software that hopefully one day I can really, really dive into and take my teeth into it. But right now I'm trying to focus on drawing and Art and animation. This, this project was more or less like taking a break from drawing. You never know, you just need to take a break from what you're trying to do. There's no harm in that. Sometimes taking a break helps your brain、uh, reset, you know. Even in the Bible, it talks about.、Uh, I think Jesus tells his disciples to come and rest. You know, I know that this isn't discipling or preaching the word or anything, but I feel like it's still applicable. You know, there's a lot of parallels in there.、Um, I think with anything, if you just take a break, take a deep breath, relax. And just, you know, refresh everything. You can get a new perspective on, on things in life and what you're trying to do. Maybe you can reevaluate what you're trying to accomplish with your hobbies, or, you know, maybe, maybe you just need to take a break and just forget it all, you know.、Um, sometimes that's beneficial.
That was a lot of fun. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did enjoy it, please, I encourage you to go find one of these. They sell dinosaurs, tractors, trucks, cars, all kinds of stuff. Whatever you do, whatever you create, I encourage you to send me an image on the Rodney Creates Facebook page. I would love to see it and love to see what you guys are interested in. If you like this video, please like, share, and subscribe. And I encourage you to join me next time when we paint this sucker. I think that would be a lot of fun. All right, guys. See you next time, and God bless.